For those of us in Monaco at the Mission Control Centre, it is half past midnight and in Amenabad right now, where Solar Impulse is, it has just gone 5 a.m. Now the next leg is, we hope, imminent this morning from Amenabad to Varanasi in Uttar Pradesh. But uh, we have some breaking news for you. Uh, you may have seen this already on Twitter. We've sent this in our Twitter feed. There is a slight delay. Now we had a chat with the pilots earlier and we just asked for a bit of an update from our pilot André Borschberg and also Bertrand Picard. Let's have a look. Uh, I think it's not so much challenges, it's more about uh, preparing our, our flights over the uh, oceans. So it's building, building up our homes, really feeling comfortable in this airplane. We'll continue to do some test flights as well. So it's mission training on, on one side, test flight on the other side is to bring the airplane to the next destination and of course it's to meet all these wonderful people, government, officials, public I hope to give him the airplane in the best condition, in the same condition I received it from him when he arrived it here. Did you? I hope at this point that you can take off because we still have no clearance, the custom has still grounded the plane and the ATC has said we cannot clear the plane if we don't have the papers of custom and there are two different opinions inside the custom, so we don't yet know. At this point, the administration lets us go. So you see the type of challenges we have. If we want to fly around the world, it's not only flying. It's a lot about administration. And if there is no adventures anymore in the future, it's not because of lack of ideas. It's because of excessive administration. This I can tell you. Excessive administration, who'd have thought that would be the problem today? It's usually the weather, but uh, th this changes things a little bit. I've got our flight director, Raymond Claire, with us now, the, uh, the man who's going to give the final decision on whether the plane can take off. Hi, Ray. Hey. Uh, hi, good morning. Good morning to you. Now, so, excessive administration, this is what we're dealing with today. So, can you give us a bit more information? Yeah, I think uh, we are still missing some uh, document. Uh, <laughs> immigration or I don't know exactly they asked uh, us to provide the flight plan from uh, Muscat to Ahmedabad which we flew one week ago we were immediately sending back uh, to India and now the status is the plane is ready Andre is on board uh, so we still have 30 minutes before takeoff and it's just to re re receive the release from the administrative uh, there. I think it's a little bit with immigration and so I'm a little bit surprised because we are there since one week and uh, the problem arises this morning. From a technical point of view, whether everything looks fine and we have a latest takeoff at uh, nine local there. So we have about three hours margin if we need. Uh, before we, we will have to cancel the flight if we don't receive the authorization. Thank okay, you. so luckily weather is not really a problem, so we do, as you say, have a bit of time. We can wait a bit, as long as Andre doesn't get too bored sitting well, in the cockpit and waiting. He should be I, fairly comfortable. Yes, he could train some resting, maybe. That's not a bad idea, and we can <laughs> see now, I think, uh, the cockpit. There's Andre there with his bandana on still, staying relaxed, looking calm, and uh, this is something that that Andre does in particular, isn't it? He seems to have a hat for every country he's in, for every <laughs> airport he's in as well. It was a, in Oman he had a nice hat, in America he was wearing a Stetson. 
So Andre is keeping his cool as he often does. Um, he does manage the stress very well, doesn't he? Sure, yeah, yeah. Uh, when we had the update briefing, he was not aware of this problem initially, and I just asked, uh, do you know about the problem? No, I said, okay, concentrate on your flight and so, and Greg and Bertrand and the rest of the team, they will work on this issue, and you concentrate on the flight, this is important for you. And he said, it's exactly what I'm meaning. Okay, so if you just join us, speaking to Raymond Clair, the flight director here at the Monaco Mission Control Center, there is a delay to take off. Now, usually this is because the wind isn't quite as settled as we'd like. This time it's for a piece of paper. Uh, we're expecting a man to be running across somewhere, brandishing a piece of paper, saying, right now you have the permission to take off. Uh, it's more in Varanasi than in Ahmedabad. Is that right, Ray? The, uh, it's really just to allow them to to land in Varanasi, or is it also in Ahmedabad? No, no, it's just to be allowed to move out of the parking position oh, in Ahmedabad. It's as simple Ahmedabad. as that. It's yes. simple as that, just to get yeah. us off where we are and take off. Yes. Okay, and the flight window